So the next question says, the blank rate is the interest rate that banks charge each other for borrowing or storing money. Um, one is Federal Reserve interest, two is loan interest, three is the federal funds uh, rate, and four is none of the above. And so, uh, you know, I think this is really just a definition-based question. Um, you know, if uh, we just have to be very familiar with the terms for um, some of the tools that uh, monetary uh, of monetary policy. And so if we're familiar with those definitions, we know that the answer here is going to be three. Uh, the federal funds rate is the interest rate that banks ch are charge each other for borrowing or storing money. And so um, this is kind of the idea that like uh, one bank might need to borrow money from another bank. And so the question is, you know, we go to a bank for a loan, who does the bank go for loans? So the question can either be they take out loans from other banks or they can take out a loan from the Fed. And so if you take out a loan from the other bank, obviously the bank is still going to charge interest. And there's a special interest rate that banks charge each other for borrowing or storing money, and that is the federal funds rate. So that's something that is regulated by the, uh, the, Fed uh, the Federal Reserve as they are the, monitor as the central monetary body. And so um, they will set the federal funds rate um, in a way so that it will kind of accomplish the uh, approximate effect on the money supply that the, uh, that the uh, Federal Reserve is trying to aim for. There's also um, something that is often confused, I think even uh, when I was start first learning this, uh, I was also confused, is uh, the difference between the federal funds rate and the discount rate. So it's important to note that the federal funds rate is the interest rate that banks are charging each other, whereas the uh, discount rate is the rate at which people are uh, charging banks, uh, sorry, the rate at which the Fed is charging banks for overnight loans um, that um, you're taking directly from the Federal Reserve deposit. And so um, those are two slightly different things. Uh, and so just remember the difference of those when we're talking about the definitions. Okay, let's take a look at the previous tier's answers. So previous tier says the federal funds rate as well. And they say that the federal funds rate is the interest at which banks and other depository institutions extend loans to each other on an uncollateralized basis overnight. Reserve balances are held by banks in the Federal Reserve to maintain the reserve requirements. Banks with surplus reserve balance in their accounts lend funds to those who are under a deficit. The interest rates charged on such loans is known as the federal funds rate. The federal funds rate is a crucial instrument of the Federal Reserve's monetary policy and it's utilized to influence the money supply in the market. Yeah, so this is a great... Uh, kind of covering the basis. All we really had to know here was the definition. We don't have to really understand how this, the mechanism by which this affects the, uh, the money supply. So this is a good enough answer for, for the purposes of this question. Okay.